on this program, well, you'll notice, uh, and then during the show, we'll be talking about the KEEP. It's M-C-E-A-P, and it's kind of a long word to type out. So we, can, we just um, call it the KEEP, that way it's shorter. And that stands for the Montgomery County Emergency Assistance Program. So uh, that's what, when the people say the KEEP, that's what they're talking about. And their clothing bank is, happens to be right across the, the street here. I want to tell you, I went shopping with four of our volunteers and the volunteers who work at the Blacksburg Clothing Bank um, to pick out my outfit. And the thrill of the bargain and putting the outfits together was so much fun. You're just going to be amazed when you see the clothes and accessories that our volunteers found in Christiansburg, Blacksburg, and Radford stores. We're trying to promote and highlight the going green aspect of this show. And we want you to know that is why we've used cloth tablecloths and dish, china dishes for the church. You've also, I understand, made it a mission of going green. And the napkins and the candles were collected from the YMCA thrift shop and the emergency assistance thrift stores. So everything that's on your tables, uh, you know, has been donated or recycled in some way. Most of the clothing banks that um, send that they send their unusable clothing to the wine safe thrift shop in Blacksburg, where if it's badly torn or stained and can't be worn, it's recycled into things such as insulation. So we want you to know these clothing banks are all working to promote our um, environment of being healthy. They're not throwing things in the landfills. Everything's being recycled in some way. And I think that, that they should all be applauded for doing that. And I think the last proposed thing <laughs> brought rugs and dolls that are back on the table that are made from some discarded clothing and that uh, were just torn and, and, and somehow they made these beautiful things out of these old clothes. So there are Get your minds to work and so you might find some things you, you can do with, with a little or nothing. Okay, I want you to sit back, enjoy the show, and I uh, would like to introduce Shirley Peterson, who is the Vice President of our RSVP Advisory Council and the Coordinator of the Fashion Show. She will be guiding us through the show today, so enjoy. Thank you. 
just as brilliant one to Diane. Thank you, Diane. Okay, let's welcome four very brave children. First is Landon, wearing a knit shirt by George, khaki shorts by Arizona, and <clears throat> by Arizona jeans, and his leather sandals are SRG. Total cost was $1.50 at the McKee Blue. Sarah, looking good in a pink top by Ralph Lauren, denim and denim overhaul by Surfer. Total cost was $1 at the McKee Clothing Bank. Nathan, sporting a blue Hawaiian print shirt by Cherokee, khaki shorts by Lee. Total cost was a dollar. McKee Clothing Bank. And Megan is wearing a precious seersucker dress with embroidery cherries on the hem line. Total cost a dollar fifty. McKee Clothing Bank. These great kids are Elaine Clark's adoptive grandchildren. Elaine is one of our stage manager managers today, and Nathan is her is her real grandchild, <laughs> or blood grandchild. But aren't these kids cute? Like good looking kids. And then you can walk back that way, and that man is going to help you. Joe is going to help you down. Thank you very much. <laughs> walk down the aisle, guys. Let everybody see you. Buck serves his community well in many, many ways. 
and Buck is a proud member of the Marine Corps League. Let's give Buck a hand. Our next model is Sarah Carter. You don't need to break the bank to look expensively dressed, do you? Sarah quells that myth, wearing a Caribbean Joe rayon dress, sporting it in distinctive island print. Complementing the look is an Adolfo Studio jacket and a luscious car. Fabric is 100% cotton. Sarah will make a great appearance at any function. Cost one dollar at the rack. I'm sorry, ten dollars. We have an expensive item here at the Radford Clothing Bank. Another great RSVP volunteer, Sarah is very active in all aspects of Girl Scout projects. Sarah's looking great. She would be looking great on a cruise, out for the afternoon. Let's give Sarah a hand. Thank you, Sarah. Mary Moyer is our next model. Mary is a vision of grace and glamour in this angle-length gown. All heads will be turning. The deep black of the gown is enchanted with midnight blue embossed glitter gems. The design is by notation. The cost is $10, second time around. Mary is assistant manager of Second Time Around Thrift Shop. She is also an RSVP member. That's a great glamorous look. And Mary wears it well, doesn't she? Thank you, Mary. Our next model, you we are all familiar with, Eva Supton. And Eva will, Eva will be escorted by Brenda West. Eva is charming in a Miss Dolby suit. Has an abstract design of navy green and white, shown with the navy shell. Eva will be a showstopper whenever she wears this suit. Her look is classy and up to date. Cost two dollars and fifty cents. The key clothing thing. <laughs> Eva is a great quilter. She, along with others, sew and design the quilts that we use to raise money for our various RSVP projects. Eve has been a delight to work with. We were very happy to have her as a model. Thank you, Eva. Our next model is Merrill Nelson. Merrill proves casual can be a cutting edge fashion statement. Wearing a cropped pant with a matching top, the shade is a brilliant turquoise with a navy and lime detail. The design is by Ali Miles and the fabric is a Brennan Rayon Linen Blend. The cost is $2. McKee Clothing Bank. Merrill's 
serves as a court-appointed special advocate for children. She deserves a hand for that. model and has modeled before us, so we were lucky to get her to model for us. Okay, a little change of pace. We have Cassie Ligas and Jacob, Jacob Minnick. Cassie is a delight in her youthful look. She's wearing a hot pink Z Universe sleeveless top combined with a cropped pant, a blend of rayon and nylon. The shade is pale gray with a muted pink stripe. The cost is $2 at the McKee Clothing Bank, the outfit. Now Jacob is very handsome in his black pleated trousers. <laughs> combined with a green Oxford shirt, accented with a blue-green tie. The cost for his outfit is $2 at the Heat Clothing Bank. Jacob is the son of Cindy Minnick, who, who serves on the RSVP Council. She also is the smiling face at the Meadowbrook Library. And Cassie is the granddaughter of Shirley Lakers one of our very busy RSVP volunteers. Serving at the clothing bank and with the reading rangers are just a few of the things that she does for RSVP. <laughs> our next model is Lois Wade. Lois is stunning in a two-piece sag farmer design, a carefree fabric in a bright tangerine muted print. The semi-diagonal cut of the skirt adds additional interest. Great choice for a dinner date. We hope she has one. <laughs> the cost is $3 at the Keep Clothing Bank. Lois spends much of her time at Heritage Hall. It's been suggested by her family that she fill out a change of address form. <laughs> the staff and residents are truly blessed to have Lois. Thank you, Lois. Our next model, and this is going to be a great one, is Joyce Epperly. Here, without a doubt, is the perfect little black dress. It can be casual or dressy. The design is by Rena Rowan. The fabric is silk acetate. Detailing straps in natural beading with a black accent. The cost is $3. They keep clothing bag. I would like to mention that Joyce was chosen to be the recipient of the prestigious Frist Humanitarian Award this year. Joyce is a volunteer at Montgomery County Hospital. Thank you, Joyce. Our next model will be Marjorie Wright. Now, cleats are always in fashion. Marjorie models this two-piece summer classic 
by Alfred Dutter in Easy Wear Polyester. Bright ocean aqua with a purple and pink flower print. The cost is $3.50 at the Goodwill. is dedicated also to the residents that live at Heritage Hall, along with her friend and sidekick Lois. They have everything under control at Heritage Hall. Impeccably designed by John Meyer. 
intricate beading accents, the classic cardigan style jacket. Esther looks as though she just stepped out of the pages of Harper's Bazaar. <laughs> is five dollars the key clothing bank. Esther is an RSVP volunteer and committed to her church in many many projects too numerous to mention and we are so proud to have Esther here today. Thank you. These models were very brave to do what they what they volunteered for, and we appreciate that. It took a lot of time and a lot of effort. So we're very happy that they agreed to model. And Esther never complained. <laughs> <laughs> While Esther is making an exit, Dot Finch is waiting in the background. She's making a glamorous entrance in this special occasion gown. A deep rosy burgundy of black design by Candy Rocket. Cost $5 McKee Clothing Bank. Dot is active. With the Animal Health Alliance as, and is responsible for feeding all those feral cats out there. And those cats love her and we need someone to do that. They trap these feral cats, they neuter them, but still continue to feed them. She needs a big hand for that. Our next model is Cookie Davis. Vintage, meaning high quality from the past. It is definitely highlighted in this ankle length, two piece, rayon dinner dress in twilight blue. The design is by Spencer Alexis. The lace inserts with fine detailed embroidery adorn the jacket. Frog style closings complete the style. Cost is $2 at the Blacksburg Clothing Bank. <laughs> Cookie volunteers at the Blacksburg Clothing Bank. She's involved in mission work, projects, and toys for tots. And we appreciate her coming over here from Blacksburg. Our next model is Ken Murdoch. Okay, ladies. Ken is our resident bachelor and player. Modeling today a men's play combo, a short pant with matching top of royal blue with white and yellow tropic print. The outfit is by Sunset Breeze, the hat by Dorfman Pacific. The cost is five dollars. McKee Clothing Bank. <laughs> Ken is a volunteer at the Montgomery Regional Hospital and, of course, a member of RSVP. Thank you, Ken.
Margie is wearing a one-piece suit with a bold hibiscus print in lime, aqua, and shades of blue. Detailed straps in the back and shown here with a matching skirt cover-up. Design is by Sessa. The fetching straw hat and bag complete the outfit. The cost, entire outfit, $4.50, McKeith clothing bag. Margie is manager of McKeith Clothing Bank and is a volunteer at the Women's Resource Center and does many, many more things, too numerous to mention. <laughs> now, before we bring out our last model, which I know you're all waiting for, we would like to thank our stage directors. So we would like Dina Flincham and Elaine Clark to come out. These are the girls that got the bottles out here. They dressed them. They helped them. We could not have done this without those two ladies that were on this stage. Okay, this is what you're waiting for. Our next model is Angela Little. show this afternoon with Angela, our much adored and admired friend and leader, wearing this bold and sassy combination that shouts current and classy, a black slouchy pant, the design is by Bonworth, paired with a lipstick red fitted suede jacket by Giorgio Fiolini, completing the outfit, a black and white abstract pin print with a flattering square neckline by French Connection. <laughs> Thank you, Margie. I'm not saying anything about Margie. There is not an officer, Angela or Margie, that could be said. Thank you, Angela. So let's give them a hand. 